I'm Johnny, and it's time for your prescription. Because let me tell you, I'm not just a mad scientist, I'm also a pharmacist. Do you suffer from lack of motivation, crippling self-doubt, lethargy, unfinished projects? Then you should consider Chicksent. Chicksent is a new drug that may be right for you. Chicksent provides intense concentration, time dilation, emerging of action and awareness, a loss of reflective self-consciousness, including that little voice inside your head that says, Hey, Johnny, you're no good for shit. A sense of agency over what you're doing and a sense that the work that you're doing is intrinsically rewarding. The side effects of Chick Scent include and are not limited to feeling like you have the potential to succeed, loss of appetite, tunnel vision, feeling so engrossed in an activity that all other needs become meaningless. Chick Scent will help you overcome the challenges and attaining your ultimate goals and give you a sense of satisfaction in and of itself. Ask your shaman or psychoanalyst if Chick Scent is right for you. If you haven't figured it out yet, we're talking about the psychological state of flow. This is a state that was identified by this guy who's got the coolest name ever. Mihail Csikszentmihalyi. I'm not even kidding. That's his name. Csikszentmihalyi. I'm probably butchering the pronunciation, but damn, it's a cool name. The actual spelling with all the diacritics and weird accent marks are in the doobly-doo. The state of flow is when you're so deeply involved in your work that the world just falls away. You're not using a paintbrush. You are the paintbrush. In Russia, the paintbrush uses you. In Russia, the paint brushes you. This could be related to the concept of Wu Wei or acting without acting that those bloody moon pointers are always talking about. Now wait, 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 wait just one second. I've used Moo Pointer like three times so far and I haven't even explained it. It's time for a detour. There's no derogatory term for a Zen Buddhist. Catholics, you can call them Mary worshipers. You can call Wiccans a pile of sticks. There's nothing that you can really call Zen Buddhists. So I came up with moon pointers. Moon pointers comes from this old saying, which is talking about Zen is like a finger pointing at the moon. You're pointing to the moon, but the finger is not the moon. The state of flow is very important if you're going to be doing any creative work. It is something that needs to be cultivated. If you've ever been there, you know what I'm talking about. It can be ruined really easily. But the good news is, is that you can actually cultivate this much like a flower. And flowers need three things, the sun, water, and soil. And the state of flow needs three things. The state of flow needs clear rules for attainment, challenge, and immediate feedback. The feedback is like water. Think about the cycles of water. The feedback has to be immediate. So computer programmer guys have this thing called unit testing that's super powerful. You test this little small chunk of code and it uh, passes or fails. The soil is all about the clear rules for attainment. You have to know what you're doing. It can't be this fluffy, oh, I'm going to make a jungle track. You should have a really good idea of what it is you're going to build before you start building it. Otherwise, you'll just be thrashing around. This is why when you're mixing a song, it's very important to have a reference track that is a track that somebody else has mixed that you can refer to that has the same sonic qualities that you're after. And in fact, that can also provide you a level of feedback as well. The boundaries are fuzzy. That's why the David Allen method of getting things done is so amazing because it gives you this ability to clearly define what the goal is and the steps to attain it. It's a real boon if you want to get into the state of flow. If you follow GTD properly, it's like flow mulch. It is so healthy for those happy little flow flowers. Finally, there's the sunny energy of challenge. And there's two different factors here. There's the skill that you have and the challenge of the task. If you have high skill, I challenge, then you're in that magical place of flow. So that's it. Those are the three things. If you can remember all about the sun shower flow flowers, you'll be good to go.
And of course, the moment you've all been waiting for, tips for single guys from Justine. Find yourself a hobby besides fucking video games. What are the things? What are the activities? What are the arts, the crafts, the macrames that get you into this state of flow? I really want to know about this. Let me know in the comments. So remember, kids, sun shower flow flowers. 